Hey there, welcome back to my channel. Today, let's talk about romance summer. Now, when it comes to romance manga, I'm all about that mature couple vibe. I mean, high school love is all well and good, but let's be real, mature couples bring a whole new level of realism to the table. And there just aren't enough romance stories out there, with protagonists who are past their high school days. So today, I'm here to share some underrated and still ongoing romance manga with the mature couples, that you absolutely need to add to your reading list. Let's get started. Number 1. Koyunogai by Saoryu. Koyunogai follows the story of MC and FMC. After they escape their toxic relationships. Through fate, they encounter with each other and embark on a new story. The manga opens with the MC engaged in a phone conversation with his girlfriend, who bombards him with nagging and intrusive questions that reflect the toxicity of their relationship. Despite being adults, the girlfriend's doubts and accusations create a suffocating environment for the MC, impacting his responsibilities in personal space. Meanwhile, the FMC finds herself in a relationship with a controlling boyfriend, who's seemingly caring, but didn't realize that he'd just being annoying and nuisance towards FMC. His constant restrictions and demands encroach on the FMC's freedom, highlighting the strain of her toxic relationship. With that, both MC and FMC reach a breaking point, and decide to end their respective toxic relationships, setting the stage for a new shift in their lives. Fate intervenes as the MC and FMC cross paths through an online game, that leads to a real-life gathering, organized by their gaming guild. The chemistry and connection between them during their first meeting, signal the beginning of an intriguing new story. This manga is seriously one of the best romance I've come across. The characters are so intriguing, and the dynamic between the main duo is just a joy to follow. They've had some rough dating experience in the past, so for now they're all about that friends with benefits vibe. But hey, as the story progresses, who knows the feelings might just start to sneak in. I'm hoping this gem gets the recognition it absolutely deserves, and the mangaka keeps blessing us with more awesome chapters. Number 2. Asoko Day, Hadaraka Musubusen, by Mori Taishi. This manga revolves around 24-year-old Goro Sugami, who finds himself smitten with Musubu Kondu, a dedicated researcher at a rubber products manufacturing company. An opportunity arises for Sugami to work alongside Musubu, when he got transferred into the same department. Their initial encounter lacks warmth or charm. Musubu just casually greets Subaru and hands him a gift. When Subaru looks at the present, he finds a condom. Despite the unexpected turn of event, Sugami remains determined to pursue his feelings for Musubu. I read this manga some times ago. The waifu immediately hooked me to read this manga. To my pleasant surprise, it turned out to be a truly delightful series. This underrated gem offers a charming tale of romance. The progression of their romance is truly captivating, in my opinion, this manga deserves an anime adaptation. With 72 chapters so far, it's a shame why no studio has yet picked up this gem. It's a manga that possesses the potential, and it's disheartening to see it overlooked, while omit manga receive anime adaptation. I hope that this manga will receive the attention it truly deserves. I could see this series will get more popular if it get anime adaptation. If you haven't read this manga, you guys need to read it. And that's all for ongoing romance manga that I can recommend for now. If I find any good romance with a dull protagonist, I will definitely make a video about it. For now let us enjoy these two hidden gem manga. Also don't forget to give support to the author. For those who already following this series, tell me your opinion about this manga. Thanks for watching guys, see you again in the next video.